And it was the first day of school for many students in the South Valley, but instead of teachers welcoming them back to class with a smile and handshake, they were greeting their students through their electronic devices. Our Kaylee Hunt has more on how they plan to kick off virtual learning. So I have been out on several campuses this morning um, and it's eerily quiet with no students. Tamara Reveline is the superintendent of Visalia School District. She says normally the first day of school would be full of excitement, but today they are getting used to this new normal. We're all feeling like first year teachers. Even if somebody has taught 20, 30 years, this is brand new. And so the, the people, the teachers, the staff, parents, students have to give themselves and others a lot of grace right now. Raveline says they have been distributing Chromebooks to their students, along with training teachers on how to use them. It's going to be a bumpy experience. We're going to have lots of glitches, but a first day with 27,000 students is often going to be that way when you're using new technology. Greg Price with the Visalia Teachers Association says on top of fixing the electronic glitches, teachers are asking to change the current schedule, which has them teaching half their classes in the morning and the other half in the afternoon, to teaching them all at once to allow more time with their students. Tulare City School District also started Thursday morning. I don't think any of us in education started to be uh, digital learning teachers. Brian Holing said what Tulare City School District says he is confident in his teachers and students and the next few weeks they will work out the bugs of online learning. Kaylee Hunt, KC24 Local News That Matters.